The Consort Gui Doulu was the Consort Gui of Tang Ruizong. In Tang official historical documents, old book of Tang and new book of Tang, no records about her. In 1992, Doulu's tomb was found in Luoyang. Then her stories were known by today's people. Doulu clan was a very famous clan in Sui and Tang dynasties. The consort Gui Doulu's great grandmother was Princess Changle, the little sister of Emperor Wen of Sui. Doulu's uncle, her father's older brother, was Grand Chancellor in Wu Zetian's time. In six seventy six. Doulu married Prince Xiang as a concubine at age fifteen. She was one of Prince Xiang's favorite women. In six eighty four, Wu Zetian promoted Prince Xiang to the emperor, known as Emperor Ruizong. Ruizong promoted his wife Liu Shi as the empress. Doulu became the consort Gui, the highest rank consort. Tang Xuanzong's biological mother Dou Shi was promoted to consort De. After becoming the emperor, Ruizong and his family members moved into the imperial palace. They had the best living conditions, but. Didn't have happy life. Starting from the late Tang Gaozhong's time, the government was controlled by Wu Zetian. To keep the absolute political powers, Wu Zetian already killed her first two sons. Ruizong's older brother Zhongzong only worked as the emperor for about one month. And was demoted by Wu Zetian. In 690, Ruizong was forced to voluntarily pass the throne to his mother. Ruizong lost his emperor title. Accordingly, his imperial women lost the empress consort's title. Three years later, an imperial maid tried to seduce Ruizong. But didn't succeed. To avenge, she falsely accused Ruizong's two favorite women, the Empress Liu and the Consort Dou, cursed Wu Zetian. Later, Wu Zetian ordered Empress Liu and the Consort Dou to visit her, and secretly kill them. Wu Zetian even didn't send their bodies to home. In the same day, Wu Zetian also killed Ruizong's other two imperial women. Dou Lu was safe, partially because her original family had great relationship with Wu Zetian, partially because she had great personalities. After Ruizong was demoted, he and his families were placed under home arrest. As Ruizong's highest-ranked consort, Dou Lu raised Ruizong's second and third sons. Ruizong's second son was called Li Hui. His biological mother Liu Shi's grandfather Liu Shi was the brother of the Empress Wang's mother. After Wu Zetian became the Empress. All her political enemies had bad endings. Because of the relationship with the Empress Wang, Wu Zetian really hated Liu Shi. So even though Liu Shi gave birth a kid for Ruizong, she never got a formal title. Now we don't know Liu Shi was killed by Wu Zetian or naturally passed away. Wu Zetian appointed Dou Lu to raise Li Hui. Dou Lu carefully took care of Li Hui and raised him as her biological son. 
But Liu Shi's death made this mother and son relationship become very complicated. So after Li Hui grew up, she didn't visit Dou Lu very much. In February seven zero five. Wu Zetian was forced to retire. Tang Zhongzhong became the emperor. Ten months later, Wu Zetian passed away. In December seven zero six, Dou Lu's uncle begged Zhongzhong to allow Dou Lu to come back home. Zhongzhong agreed. In seven ten, Ri Zhong became the emperor. Because he didn't formally divorce with Dou Lu, Dou Lu kept her consort Gui title, but didn't move back to the imperial palace. In the Tang Dynasty, the consort Gui Dou Lu was the only imperial woman who lived outside the imperial palace. Now we guys. Dou Lu lived Ri Zhong for several reasons. First, the relationship between Dou Lu and Ri Zhong became horrible. Dou Lu was one of Ri Zhong's favorite women, but in Wu Zetian's time, Ri Zhong's four imperial women were killed in the same day. Well, Dou Lu got Wu Zetian's favor. Ri Zhong hardly still loved her. Second, Dou Lu personally experienced cruel political battles. She was eager to have a peaceful life, so she wanted to leave the royal family. Third, in Zhong Zhong's time, inner court was disordered. Many high-rank imperial women had personal resort outside the imperial palace. This gave Dou Lu the opportunity to leave the royal family. Fourth, the Dou Lu clan worried Dou Lu and the Ri Zhong's personal res- relationships affect the relationship between Dou Lu clan and the royal clan. So, from the political perspective, Dou Lu clan also supported Dou Lu leave the royal family. Dou Lu's ending wasn't bad. Besides Li Hui, Dou Lu also raised Ri Zhong's third son Li Longji, who was Tang Xuanzhong. He really appreciated what Dou Lu did for him. He took care of Dou Lu very well. In seven forty, Dou Lu passed away at age seventy nine. Choosing her tomb's location became a problem. Ri Zhong passed away in seven sixteen and was buried in Qiaoling. As Ri Zhong's consort, Dou Lu should be buried in Qiaoling, but. They divorced based on facts, so Tang Xuanzhong buried Dou Lu in Luoyang and built a tomb for him for herself. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon.